Filipino star Steven the Sniper Lohman could be one win away from a crack at Fabricio Andrade's one bantamweight MMA world title. On September 29th at 1 Fight Night 14, Stam vs. Ham on Prime Video, the number 2 ranked contender squares off with former bantamweight Kingpin and number 1 ranked contender John Hens of Stone Linka in a must watch, high stakes showdown. Slated to air live in US primetime from the Singapore Indoor Stadium, the fight could determine the pecking order at the top of once loaded bantamweight MMA division. Last November, the 28 year old took out former longtime one bantamweight MMA world champion Bibiano Fernandez, securing the biggest victory of his decade long career. He's now overjoyed to return to action for an even bigger opportunity and assert himself as the division's undeniable top contender. The sniper told Onef.com. When I found out that he was the one I would be facing, I expected one to give us a fight for the number one contender spot in the division. At least now we have a fight. We won't be idle for too long before the year ends. So, it's really great news for me. Undefeated in one with three thrilling victories, Lohman, of course, would have been happy to receive a world title shot on the strength of his last win over Fernandez. But with Andrade set to soon battle Jonathan Haggerty for the vacant one bantamweight kickboxing world title, Lohman knows that staying busy and picking up a victory against Lanker will only strengthen his case for a crack at 26 pounds of gold. He added, I need to get a big win against John Lanker. Then if I win, I know I'm next for Fabricio Andrade. No more qualms, no more anything, I'm next in line for a championship fight. Well-rounded and in the thick of his athletic prime, Steven Lohman will need to be at the top of his game against John Lanker, one of the most feared knockout artists in the history of mixed martial arts. The Team Lockheed representative is willing to engage in a striking battle with hands of stone but he'll approach the Brazilian's trademark brawling style strategically. He said, Our style, which relies a lot on movement, is an effective way to strike as long as we have a tight guard and we can absorb shots well. If I do that, then I will have an effective style against Lanka because as you move and you hit your opponent, you gain points. And if we connect squarely, we can even get a knockout. It's really a great style to use because I move a lot while creating angles. Whether he's sticking and moving or trading heavy leather in the center of the circle. Lohman's leaving no stone unturned as he prepares for his pivotal September 29th clash with Lanka. He said, I think I match up with his striking well because he's an inside fighter. So I'll train for that style while I have the time. I'll train everything so I can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with him. I'll polish everything and use every single one of my tools.